Hi, welcome to the module Python for Data Science. I am Neeraj, your instructor for the module. Before we begin, let me tell you a few things about this module. This module is aimed at beginners in Python. So even people who are well versed in other programming languages such as Java but new to data science are expected to go through this module since the syntax may be different. We will be learning basic Python in this module which will be sufficient to get you started with data analytics. And as you will progress to the other modules, you will pick up some advanced Python skills. This module has been supplemented with lots of questions and hands-on exercises to make you comfortable with Python as much as possible. That is all good, but you must be thinking why did we only choose Python and not R, Java or any other language for this module. Let me tell you why. Python is an open source language. So, you do not need to worry about licensing fees or purchasing softwares for your analytics tasks. Coding in Python is similar to writing logic in English. And this is one of the reasons for its popularity. You don't have to write a large code just to print a statement. For example, a sample code to print hello world in C looks like this. Here we can see that we need to first import some input output libraries, then create a main function and finally print hello world. Java is no less. In order to print hello world in Java, you need to first create a class, define the main function and then proceed with printing the hello world statement. But things are pretty much simple in Python. You can directly print hello world using the print method and that is it. No hassle of creating a class or defining main function etc. Python takes care of all that by itself. Another reason why we chose Python for this module is it's very large and active developer community. So in case you are stuck somewhere, you will always find a solution with a simple Google search or by asking somebody. And because of this, there has been some awesome contributions to the Python packages repository, like scikit-learn for machine learning algorithms and pandas for handling data, etc. I gave you reasons enough to be motivated to learn Python. Let's get started by installing Python first. The following document has all the instructions required for installing Python on your systems. 